All right. Yeah. Just been um, working, uh, well, getting prepared for the live stream for Saturday. And um, it started clicking in, I guess, last week, but it's really starting to cement in now um, The uh, how much more focus I'm putting towards that. And I'm okay with it. At first, I was, um, I wouldn't say concerned. I'm trying to find a lighter word for it. But um, uh I was like, oh God, I'm not playing this game as much, but, uh, this, I mean, th this game led me into wanting to learn more about World War One, and, uh, you know, uh, trying to focus a lot more or doing, um, a much better job with the live streams and, uh, all these interconnections, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. I think it's, uh, it's pretty neat that I've been trying to focus on, um, you know, using the live streams to explore World War One and whatnot, and then also um, for payback. Uh, uh, to be honest with you, uh, to also uh, focus uh, a good chunk of the live streams on the the Dervelkrieg system, uh, because you know I've been stealing from it for crying out loud for my imaginative uh, play. So um, you know my ongoing narrative and everything else. Uh, so that's really about it. I think I don't know how many. I mean, I'm obviously going to still do, be doing this and it's going to be um, whatever, but I'm not so. There's no stress in the back in my mind going, God, you got to get back to the game and so on and so forth. I'm like, no, I'm just going to go at my own pace. If, if this takes me another F and whatever, it doesn't matter because um, it's all in keep lockstep or pace or whatever the heck I don't know all that you know metaphors but it's all part of me learning like week to week uh, about World War One and so on and so forth so um, and that's going to take since I'm doing it in the same vein of week to week just like the Great War uh, did the Great War Channel I've got another three years to go basically so uh, yeah no problem there anything else I think that's really about it oh I did want to show you yeah so I've been using this um uh, sometimes when it, you know, I'm looking up on my Atlas, um, for the locations to put on the, uh, shrunken down Der Velkrieg maps. Uh, the problem is it's, I think it's from the dollar store. It's got the pencil end. I just wanted the pointers. So I'm like, oh shoot. So it's little pencil bits and I've got this sweetheart. Oh my God. I can't wait to use it. Hold on. It's in a little kit. Well, look at this. So it's just the straight up pointers, I guess. So that'll be nice to try out. Um. Yeah, Oof. I can't wait to, uh, like I said, I can't wait to do, like, have a proper jet. Oh, yeah, the apron never worked for me. It's that freaking uh, thing around the neck, so I'm back to the lab coat stuff. But I still would like to get a um, custom-made uh, lab coat. With pro Now I'm going to have to get an extra pocket for the pointers. Oh, no problem there. Anyways, that's it. Um, yeah, I'm looking. Uh, this has just been, um, it's just exciting and fun as hell. Um Yet again, if I can just figure out a way of uh, living the rest of my life without uh, having work ch uh, taking up a third of it, um, God Almighty, that would be an extra third of doing uh, research in World War One and whatnot. Oh my gosh, that'd be awesome. Okay, see you later.